You're at home adding some oil to your engine, but accidentally pour too much. What do you do? Hi, my name's David, and in this video, I'll tell you exactly what you should do. Too much oil in your engine can cause liquid to splash against the moving parts of your engine. The result? The oil could start to foam and stop lubricating engine parts as it should. This can cause wear in your engine over time, which could be very expensive to repair. Now, how to solve this issue. If your level is too high, you'll have to drain the engine oil from your car. But there is another way that's a little less messy and time consuming. All you need is Before we go ahead, always make sure to work in a safe environment. Wear gloves, and when working under your vehicle, always wear eye protection. The first step is to indicate how much oil you'll need to remove. Before you begin, make sure your car is on a level surface so you'll get an accurate reading. Make sure the engine is off and let it rest for 10 minutes. Pop the hood and locate your engine oil dipstick which will usually be yellow or orange and looks like this one. Slowly pull the dipstick out and wipe it off using a paper towel. Careful because you don't want to get oil on your clothes. Trust me, I know from experience. If you'll take a closer look, you'll see these two markers. Sometimes there's lines, sometimes there's crosshatch areas, but there will always be two markers. Put the stick back in, let it sit for about four seconds so the oil can saturate it and then slowly pull it out. If you want to know more about changing or checking your engine oil, stick around. I'll put up some links to our other videos at the end of the video. As you can see, the oil level mark is a little bit beyond the upper marker, meaning you should take out some oil, but not too much. If your dipstick shows the oil at a much higher level, you'll need to remove some more. As you do, keep checking the oil level regularly to see if you're on track. Remove the dipstick, take a tube, stick it in there and put the syringe at the other end. Next, we can safely suck out some of that excess oil. Make sure you have your container ready to store the excess oil. Pull out small amounts to dispose of the excess oil. Make sure you put it in a sealed container and bring that to the appropriate recycling point, such as a local waste management site or gas stations. When was the last time you had issues with your oil level? Did you manage to deal with it properly? Did you ever use this method when you had poured in too much oil? Let us know in the comments. When you're done, check your oil level again using the dipstick and repeat the process until the level is back in between the two markers. Did you take out a bit too much? Simply and slowly add some oil. Be careful not to add too much though. To prevent from pouring in too much oil again in the future, be sure to always pour slowly and carefully. There you have it. With these three steps, you'll get the excess oil out of your engine. Step one, check your oil level. Step two, remove the excess oil with the syringe. Step three, check again and repeat. We have plenty more videos for you, so make sure you hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.